While some restaurants are closing their doors for good because of the pandemic, others are opening, including a new restaurant on the city's south side called Felipe's 109. That's where we find News 5's Ashley Portillo live with a look at how business is rebounding. Hey, Allison, Felipe's 109 opened for business this weekend, but it actually started as a food truck in May of last year, right in the middle of the pandemic. And the owner earlier told me that that actually helped his business instead of hinder it. Thank you. While the restaurant industry took a big hit during the pandemic, the food truck industry saw more business. Because of the pandemic, people were looking for food trucks in neighborhoods. People were looking for food trucks on the street because restaurants were closed. Felipe Velasquez owns Felipe's 109, a taco burger restaurant on South Academy. The business started as a food truck in May of last year. It's scary, obviously, and it's, and it's joyful at the same time. When you get lemons and water, you make lemonade. After successfully running the food truck for most of 2020. I don't think we'd make it in 2019. Food trucks weren't a thing back then. Velasquez and his family took the leap of faith to open a brick and mortar. There was no other time to do it than the time of now. Still serving customers through a window, but this time a drive through Getting some more lunch for the second time since he's been open. And Velasquez says his dream turned into reality with help from the community. I think it's awesome. I mean, small businesses, you know, you got to try to keep them, try to keep them afloat. It, it's been so joyous that the community has come together for this place and, and want to stop by and, and say hi. The dining room here at Felipe's 109 does remain closed at this time, and the owner tells me he's keeping an eye on COVID cases and will open the dining room sometime soon. Allison. And Ashley, I'm curious, he, he mentioned, you know, this kind of increasing popularity in the food truck industry. What did you learn today about how it's growing during all of this? The owner did tell me that about five years ago, the food truck industry wasn't really established here in Colorado Springs, but over the past couple years and with the help of the pandemic, a lot of people have actually opened up a food truck business and began running it successfully. He also mentioned that moving forward, he believes that the food truck industry will only continue to grow. Always watching out for you at Colorado Springs. I'm Ashley Berthio, News 5.